What's Going Around, sponsored by Health Point Family Care. The aftermath of Thanksgiving travel already contributing to several viral illnesses, including COVID, the flu, and RSV. As medical reporter Liz Bonus explains, doctors hope people can identify symptoms early to reduce the need for critical hospital care. Hey there, everybody. Hello to you. Healthcare providers at Health Point Family Care tell us so many illnesses are going around right now with similar symptoms that you really need to be your own advocate. That means not waiting to call the doctor until you are past the point when early intervention could keep you out of the hospital. You see, one of the top reasons people are being admitted for critical care right now. Just a lot of, of respiratory viruses. So our, our COVID numbers went up in October. They came back down, we thought, and then they kind of are now right back up on the rise. We're starting to see the flu. So that means as soon as you feel cold-like or respiratory symptoms, Dr. Emily Levin says, call your doctor. She says if it's the flu, antivirals can help keep you from getting seriously ill. If it's COVID-19, you can be referred to a site which provides monoclonal antibodies. And we're using them a lot. Uh, it's an infusion can take three hours. Dr. Steve Fagans says a pill made by Merck may also soon be available to keep COVID-19 symptoms from advancing. It's been recommended for certain at-risk populations by an FDA advisory committee, but it's not yet been distributed in the U.S. for patient use. They remind us that already several health care systems are delaying non-emergency procedures in anticipation that hospital beds will be needed for patients very ill from these respiratory viruses. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Now back to you.